All right, everyone, this is Justin Williams Savoy. So this afternoon, I just wanted to make a really quick video. I was going to make a live, but something was going on funky with my YouTube uh, premium account as far as that was concerned. I got a little bit of time before I need to pick up my son from school. So I wanted to follow up on the last uh, video that I made. I have some other material that I did not get to. So um, let's go ahead and do that now and have a short, not a live, but I'll upload this um, pretty quick. So I got some prayer books and some old Bibles. Now this uh, is a German Catholic. Uh, it's a prayer book and song book, I guess is what the German says there. So, and uh, here is the binding. It's got these ribbon markers, of which I tied off. They're already a little bit frayed, but to prevent that from fraying. And then, like, for, for example, here is, like, you can see, here's a Gloria. Okay, so, and here is how the text is printed in the German. And this one, I couldn't find out. I'm not quite sure, but I think it's, like, um... Episcopal for some reason it's not I don't think that this one is Roman Catholic I'll have to further um, look up and research that but like uh, Episcopalian or Anglican but German I thinking I'll have to further look it up and I need to tie off these ribbons but there's a green and a red ribbon here nice prayer book binding both of these are quite nice. Autumn found them for me when we were at a gospel mission thrift store in town. And I had just totally passed them. I get kind of hyper-focused when I'm looking at books, but I had missed them and she pointed them out to me. So for that, I'm grateful. This is a Bible study or for Bible students, volume one. Just a nice little, I, I like small little books uh, like this. Right here, I turned it. Lesson 21, Saul. <clears throat> Talking about Saul's reign, David, 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 Solomon, the kings of the Hebrew nation, kings of Israel, kings of Judah, the divided kingdom, kings of Israel, terms of office, kings of Judah, kings of Israel and Judah. Questions here, some questions, more questions. And here's how the text is printed in these. Uh, this one, it seems quite nice. Um, and here was a revised standard. I'm happy to be getting more hardbound versions of uh, scriptures. I used to have many of these, and I had a lot of antiquarian books, but it seems like they got lost over time. Um, so this is a revised standard version, uh, here, Psalm 23, the Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He restores my soul. He leads me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil for, for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of my enemies. Thou anointest my head with oil. My cup overflows. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. And I shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever. So someone wrote this to Ralph S. Combs III from Mother and Dad, October 1957. So I'm assuming this is pretty old. Let's see here, that glare of that light. Sorry about that, guys. Um... The Holy Bible containing Old and New Testaments, Revised Standard Version, translated from the original tongues, being the version set forth A.D. 1611, Revised A.D. 1881, 1885, and A.D. 1901, compared with the most ancient authorities in Revised A.D. 1952. Thomas Nelson and Sons, New York. So there's that. Then here is a... Christianity is Christ, and I don't really know what this is about thus far. A Christian Life Library Selection, W.H. Griffith Thomas, D.D. 
and I don't really know anything about this at all whatsoever. Um, and here, let's see. To my dear daddy with love from Velma, August 1953. Christianity is Christ. Thou art the king of glory, O Christ. Thou art the everlasting son of the father. W.H. Grist Thomas, D.D. I don't know what denomination this guy would be. Printed in the United States of America. Long, it doesn't really say... Different topics here, the fact of Christ, the character of Christ, the claim of Christ, the teachings of Christ, the miracles of Christ, the death of Christ, the resurrection of Christ, the gospel of Christ, the church of Christ, the grace of Christ, the influence of Christ, the virgin birth of Christ, the meaning of Christ, the verification of Christ, bibliography and index. Oh yeah, I looked in the back of this and I did see something by B.B. Warfield back here. <clears throat> <clears throat> I'm trying to see what some of the scholars in here that I might know. Brooks, Phillips, Bishop Phillips Brooks, uh, Bishop Chadwick. I know B.B. Warfield was in here. Just scanning through, through really quick. Anyways, something for the collection, eh? Um, and then these were, I was pretty thrilled about... <clears throat> We'll start with this one. I mean, like I said, I kind of just went right past these and didn't notice them and I was looking through other books, but there was a section that had these. This is kind of um, knackered up, but there is just like a real mystical, spiritual power in these old Bibles. There are some markings in this. Um, so this is the Holy Bible containing the Old and New Testaments translated out of the original tongues with the former translations diligently compared and revised by His Majesty's special command appointed to be read in churches. So, obviously Protestant, the authorized King James Version. Oxford at the University Press, which I like. In here, little there, I found there's a little cutout little bookmarker here. Um... On the Sabbath, different verses referring to the Sabbath, how Jesus considered the law of, how did Jesus consider the law of God? How did Paul consider the commandments? How did John consider the law of God? On what law is the Sabbath commandment apart? When does the Sabbath begin and end? May we care for the sick on the Sabbath? What other kinds of works are lawful to do on the Sabbath? What may be studied and talked about on the Sabbath? So anyways, um, and does that say Brother Graham or something on there? I don't know. As we go to homes, enter homes, opening scriptures and pray with them. Proverbs 6.23. This is writing in here. I'm going to hold this because this is older. What is the date on this? Did I say the date on this already? I don't think that I did. There's some stuff from Romans that this person noted in here. How old is this Bible? Uh, it doesn't say, I don't think the exact date that this is printed. Maybe I'll find that later. John 14, 14. If you shall ask anything in my name, I will do it. To Harry Graham from Grandma Weeks for graduation. Oh, it's very special. <laughs> and I will take good care of this. And it has a good energy about it. Um, a powerful spiritual energy there. So, uh, I like that. And then, <clears throat> there's this one here. Let's open it up. It's also quite knackered. But I'll keep him in these plastics. It's falling apart, really. Look at that. <laughs> and probably, I'm probably going to be allergic to the dust that's in here. But nonetheless, another good spiritual power. A little marker in here. August 1, Thursday. Their sins and iniquities I'll remember no more. Hebrews 10, 17. All thy sins left far behind thee, buried in the Savior's grave. Never more to be remembered, covered near oblivion's wave. Oh, the depth of God's forgiveness, hearken, lost one, to its call from the grave of Jesus, crying, mercy, mercy, free for all. Oh, that's 
quite nice. And this version here is Cambridge, printed at Cambridge University Press. So total score, two different 1611 King James versions, one from Cambridge and one from Oxford. Glory. So thank you, God. Um, and this has got the sprinkled blood from Exodus. Oh, and this is from two from Amy. Galatians 2.20. I'm not quite sure uh, who that, but that's some very interesting handwriting, eh? Like some um, very cool calligraphy. So yeah, um, that's about the gist of it. Oh, and here's some, uh, someone wrote and notated some scriptures in here. Very cool. A lot of to Benjamin, Job 18.21. By Eglin designated the only of the palm trees. Deuteronomy 34, 3, Judges 1, 16, 2 Chronicles. Afterwards, sons of the prophet dwelt there. They said the situation of the city was pleasant. I can't read the rest of that. 2 Kings 2, 18 through 22, if I want to go look that up later. It's there. And here's another little marker from the Lord and to the Lord. September 5th. And someone wrote 1944 on this. I trusted in thee, O Lord. My times are in thy hand. Psalm 31, 14, and 15. Commit thy way to the Lord, the true and faithful guide whose love desires your friendship. He's ever at your side. Commit your way to the Lord and trust in his guiding hand to lead you through the wilderness. To every step he planned that's quite nice as well so that's about the gist of things going on here I wanted to make this video quickly to show you guys that I've spent today I'm studying quite a bit about uh, Islam and Sufism and uh, and on this note this is uh, this says here uh, it's about a collection of Islamic art, um, to the best of my knowledge, anyways. So it's, um, but that's what I spent today kind of studying mysticism and Sufism and uh, just doing stuff that needs to be done, doing work and work around the house. And um, thank you guys for joining me for this video. And I just wanted to make you guys some content real quick. Peace.